Mobiles everywhere, the technology is evolving almost in front of our eyes. They used to be just for geeks who couldn't get a girlfriend and yuppies who had too much money. Now they're part of our everyday lives. Can you remember your first mobile phone? What was it like? I remember it was a Motorola big huge brick that had a massive antenna. I was living in Exeter in uh about 1994 and I went into a store determined to buy a Nokia phone because it could save 99 numbers and I thought that sounded like the most exciting thing that was possible. In a big plastic container, it was giant, it was heavy, it was hard to hold, it got really hot, I guess that's still true today. It was very awkward, it was a big deal. Now let's fast forward to the future. What will mobile devices look like in another 20 years' time? Will there even be such a thing as a handset? Well, if I knew the perfect answer, I'm sure I'd be, you know, a millionaire. Um, we've got 65,000 R&D experts that are looking at that. But I think the speed that consumer needs are changing. You know, the phone could be t completely different. And I think when you see wearable devices, which are the new emerging technology, it could be something that goes more in that direction. That means a phone could be obsolete in that length of time. So in the future, we not should hold a phone like this. Maybe the communication in some place in my pocket, maybe something screen is in my glass, and maybe something for the music is in my air. So we, we can have a full, full I would say the curious part is that there are so many possibilities in the, in the next 40 world. Even looking a couple of years into the future on mobile phones is a challenge, so 20 years is a big ask, and it could go one of two ways. Think about cars. 20 years ago, they haven't evolved that much, so once you have a dominant design, the phones could look very much like they look today. Alternatively, we'll live in a different world. Someone will solve the battery life problem, so we'll be able to have smaller devices, we might have flexible screens, but we also might interact with phones differently. It's going to be very much that the smartphone is this device that's connecting you, but not just through the smartphone itself, it's going to be through your wearable devices, it's going to be connecting elements um, around your house, in your car. I don't think there will be mobile phones in 20 years. I think what happens, we, what we're already seeing, is that um, the integration of communication technologies into other products and the ability to just seamlessly um, connect in place to whatever compute is around you and then communicate through that. Oh, mobile will be totally different. I'm not even sure it will exist as a category. We'll have so many things that are smart. Not just phones and tablets and watches and exercise appliances, but our electric meters, maybe our shoes, maybe the tables, all sorts of things will be smart. And they'll all be sending data all around. And so the part that's mobile is us.